Hello M15X fans. Doing another video here because uh, my warranty just ran out. Um, I had hinge cracking issues as most of us have had. I just pulled out my display panel and I got another system down there. But I wanted to describe for you guys exactly what's going on with the display panel. Of course I've pulled all this apart and as you can see on this side everything's intact. We got what six seven screws six screws there that are holding in the uh, the panel and there's four of the connectors there the rest are on on the hinge there at the bottom of the screen but on this side where it was cracking they're completely destroyed now if you look there's a couple here and the screws are still there and I even got one that fell out which is amazing. So if you're wondering what's happening with your screen, if it's coming apart and you're out of warranty, that's exactly the problem. So you have, if you have something in there that you can maybe secure those down with, maybe glue them down or something, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to fix this yet. But if you have something that might be able to... Oh, another piece came off there. Um, might be able to secure those down, glue them down, you can re-secure this corner. Uh, I know a lot of people had it on the other side with all the heat from the video card or whatever. Um, my problem has always been on this side and I don't know why. Um, but if you can secure those down, maybe glue, maybe putty, maybe some kind of plastic resin probably be best. Um, you can actually put this back together reasonably for nearly nothing and actually uh, get your system back without having to send it back and pay a fortune. The alternative is of course asking them for a new panel B. I believe this is the panel B. Um, you'd have to confirm that with Alienware. You'd have to call them and ask them for this panel again. And I don't believe they'll send you all the electronics. If anybody's curious, this is what's behind the screen. Um, this down here, this piece here is actually this white piece is the Alienware logo. Now on the on the panel that goes in front of this it has Alienware on it. This whole board just lights up and uh, it filters out just the Alienware section. Um, this is behind it here is of course the inverter board for the display. You have three the four antenna wires coming up here. Um, blue, black, white and gray as you can see there. They go all the way up to the top and if anybody's curious about the order this one's the white gray, black, and blue at the end here. Um, of course you have your stereo mics here and your camera which I believe are all USB attached and they're attached to this cable here which is attached to the display cable. The display cable is really easy to get out. You have to squeeze it right about there. There's two mechanisms, one here and one there, that will release the display connector from the panel and the connector on the panel, it's a really standard connector. Uh, you can't really see it, but it's right in here. And when it says do not touch here, really you can't put any pressure on that. That's all the sensitive electronics for the display panel. You don't want to mess with that. Um, this is, of course, the Alienware logo. If I were to take this out, you'd see a bunch of lights and other things. Here's the control connectors for that. This is the control connectors for this side of the, the light pipe going up and around. And then, of course, in, uh, the same thing for the other side, so that the lights in either end will light up simultaneously. And then, of course, all the connections. The connections come down to this point, which I would think that they would connect in through here. Um, that would be my tendency. Um, but they also have a, a wire coming this way, so that might be just for this and this is the actual connection to your computer. So if you wanted to run new anything up into here, uh, you do have some space. Um, there's spacers right here if you wanted to mod your system. Um, so you can fit pretty much anything. I'll try and give you a perspective here. It's not a lot of space. Okay. But uh, if you are wondering about your hinge cracking issues, there's your problem. I have all the bits right here. 
all these pieces that came apart and I don't know what what's wrong with the materials they're using but clearly they're not doing the right job so I hope that gives you guys a good perspective on what's going on and good luck in the future